On the streets of the Liberian capital, Monrovia, a new form of artwork is grabbing attention, the human billboard. The idea, the idea just to came to my mind and I started applying it and looking at the success in it so far. Emmanuel's advertising firm employs 35 young people, most working as human billboards. His company charges 75 US dollars per day, with clients ranging from government agencies to profit businesses. It can be tough work, but it's providing an income for young people here. Some of the benefits are being some of the benefits I have been getting from it are that it helps me pay my school fees, it helps me to buy other things for myself, and so on. Now with the Liberian elections, even political parties are using body art to attract voters. This trend has changed the nature of advertising here, with many clients preferring human billboards to conventional printed ones. The difference is, if we put a big paper up, and uh, there are a lot of people who will not just stop to read. They may read, but they may not stop to read. But when you guys are posted for me, being involved with public relations, I think it's one of the best ways now that uh, we can get our messages across. It's an idea that's attracting a lot of attention, even from the tax collection agency. Liberia has a long tradition for body painting during religious and traditional rites. For advertising, it is completely new, but profitable and amusing. Bruce Boyd, TRT World, Monrovia, Liberia.